Hey everyone, this is it from Very Geek. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing something different. Uh, usually I do anime reactions, you know, episodes and whatever, what have you. But for this, I really wanted to do my reaction slash thoughts on this for Berserk. Because Berserk is probably my favorite manga of all time. Or at least top two, top three with JoJo and all that. But finally, after 20 plus years, we get the quote-unquote reunion between Casca, like, sane, not insane anymore, and Guts, like, so, this has been something I've been looking forward to for, like, years, like, obviously I didn't read it since the start of it, because I'm not, you know, I'm only 22, but I'm really excited to read this, so I really wanted to share my thoughts, so I wanted to do something different and do, like, a manga chapter, chapter, live reaction, so... Well, that being said, if you guys enjoy this and want to see more, like, live reactions for manga, uh, then yeah. So, it was supposed to come out tomorrow, but due to the internet's wonderful magic, it's already out. So, well, I'm going to start reading it. And the first page is definitely, it's about, oh, it's about, what's it called? Kentaro Miura's new work uh, with Studio Gaga Duranki, I think it is called. Duranki. Uh, yeah. Look, I mean, the artwork is amazing because this guy is, Miura is just amazing at the art, with art. Oh, the long-awaited new chapter. Look, they know we were waiting for this shit. Uh, new special issue includes a Berserk clear file. We once again return to Elf Island. Is a new life about to begin? Something is setting me up because like this sounds so hopeful. I really don't think it's gonna be like that, but we'll see. Chop chop. Oh, they cut her hair. The the queen. How's that? Um, thank you very much. But your Majesty needn't. Oh, please, this makes a fine break from my regular domestic duties. I have fun with it. Putting a girl's lovely hair in order is always enjoyable, and it's done on to you. The press truly suits you, so it's a bit of a shame. But as per your wishes, I have prepared clothes that are easy to move in, and the style of the forest gardens, and, of course, a sword. Also, she's all decked out. She's not looking like a, like all magical and queenie like she was before. So they gave her, her like, standard traditional, like, armor set. Oh, yeah, look at her. Oh, my God. Dude, it's so... Okay, I can't show the manga chapter because it's like you know copyright or whatever. It's like it's like it's similar to how anime reactions is, but I'll have <laughs> bro seeing her like haircut, armored up with a sword. Yes, this is much better. She makes a completely different impression now, bro. They're all witnessing her for the first time. Like, oh my god! Don't stare. You're making it awkward. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Uh, I remember all the things we had to say from you, mixing the, what's it called? Oh, uh, you look like a woman pirate, so cool, no, that's a big one, the Costco we knew was like a headstrong kid, remember all the things we had to save you from, makes you, what, uh, makes you wax nostalgic, don't it, it feels like forever ago, or 20 years to be more precise, man, fuck you, Mio. <laughs> man, like, I hate that, like, Puck isn't really... He's more the comedic gag character now, more than, more so than he was before. But I hate that he has to break the fourth wall. With, I know he's done it before, but man, you don't have to throw in the twenty years for that. Being hunted by the uh, heretics and Far, uh, Farney's gang; those were the days. Damn, it's been a long time since then. Really, damn. Well, Jesus. Sh sure, it's a bit hazy, but I remember you really had my back, didn't you, Isidoro, uh, Isidoro and Puck? Shucks, it ain't nothing. Uh, the girls who found me and hid me. Oh yeah, from the Holy Grounds. Uh, damn, man. This is like, th this is pretty dope. They're like going over like, uh, like, it's like going through the history. So, and it's so weird having her back like, oh man. Jesus Christ. It's so weird seeing her back like officially. Do I owe special, oh man, th this is... Honestly, this is super cool seeing her talk. I'm just waiting for guts. I'm so anxious and scared at the same time. When I could cling to you, I was always at ease. Like how a child feels about their mother or big sister. On this journey, you really were the mother that that big sister to me. No, no, not at all. I'm the one who could barely do anything for you. Yeah, so they're, they're just all pretty much just talking about like giving their thanks. I'm like, Casca's really just giving the party her thanks for... For taking care of her the whole time. So what's it called? Isidoro is looking at her sword. Even being woman, all oh, so how good are you? Oh, is she gonna f like? She's really fucking good. I've gotten pretty rusty. I can feel the weight of the sword a bit. It's been so long, dude. I'm so oh, I'm so anxious. I hate this. I hate this. And they still haven't shown guts. Oh, then I have some appropriate sparring partners for you in the storeroom. Come on out. 
What are these? Oh, like... Oh, like... Like... Oh, I guess they're like just armored people. Long ago they came to the island, they were called... Vi oh, Vikings. We took their weapons and <laughs> mounted them into golems. I've heard of them. They're pirates. Talk about... Still, are you... Antique Vikings? Jesus, what does that say? The legendary seafaring warriors reduced to this. <laughs> Jesus. I don't know. Oh, oh, she, oh, look at her in action. Oh, my God, bro. Okay. She's fighting. I don't know how they're to express my gratitude. You're my lady down on the distraught dolls underneath. Da, 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 take your word and sh um, show no restraint. Go for it. Don't mind if I do. Oh, dude, she's fighting again. Oh, my God. I know this is weird because you're not visually seeing anything. I know that uh, this is kind of different, but I just really wanted to record my reaction to this because this is something I've been waiting for. Okay, she blocked the attack. Ooh. Oh, she's she still got it, dude. She decapit did she decapitate it? I think so, yeah. Oh, look at her. Oh, bro, she's dodging with such ease, too. She dodged backwards. Bro, this chapter so far. Holy shit. Was this all before she saw Guts and, like, freaked out in, uh, 355? Ooh, man, she's fucking kicking ass, dude. Jesus. Oh, the one, uh, what's it called? This guy's just, like, more skilled than I am. She has experience fighting armored opponents. Yeah, like, that stupid, uh, was it, Boscone? They did it. I'm blown away, Koska. You're so cool. I'm shocked, to be honest, and I guess you never really forget, even if it's been a while. Been a quite the fucking while, <laughs> been years. Jesus, maybe my sparring partner guts is strong, but he's so much bigger than most enemies I'll fight. That wouldn't be a problem with you. Sometimes beneficial study other other ways. I don't mind, but thanks, Miss Koska. So you have learned how to buy your head, my Padawan. What? Okay, just throw in a random Star Wars uh, reference for Puck. Just it wouldn't start as I don't, I don't strike as, a, as true as I used to, so I'm still a miss. Let's roll. Well, shall we go study? Let's... Okay, so I think now... Okay, so is she gonna go see uh, Guts now? Oh, he hid behind the tree. Oh, that's sad. That sucks. He's like... Oh, so this is... Okay, this was after. So she did freak out, and I guess he hid behind the tree. Actually, no. This, this is probably still before. From here on, this is her predicament alone. Will she face her or wait for time and faded bonds to heal her? No matter how deep her wounds, Kos can, can now def, uh, decide for herself, thanks to you, but... No, I'll go tell her. Farnies, did that girl shoulder some new burdens in the passage of dreams, I wonder? Because I'm the one... When you were scared, it was I who pressed your heart into you. You can see him with those words we parted. Oh yeah, she. I'm thinking. I'm thinking if anything happens with Costco, it's a hundred percent gonna be Farnies that like tries to like mend everything because like, like she's just that important of a character. All right, so she's finally walking up to Guts. Farnies got her, but Guts. Guts is behind the tree. Damn, Guts is tall as shit. You can listen from over there. Oh my god, she's talking to him. I say that, but what do I have to talk about? You have good friends, of course. I know them too. Guess you have to fight me. But when we were traveling, I was like someone else in a dream. Uh, by the way, that dream sequence was fantastic. I love that. Uh, I said, is very attached to you. Imagine you taking a student under your wing. She laughs. Would have been unthinkable in the old days. He's got your headstrong streak. Though his teacher uh, was even more stubborn. But he knows his way around fighting with two blades. Just like Judo. Oh, damn. Oh, yeah. She, has, she literally has to... Oh this, is, oh, this is not good. She literally has to, like, physically deal with the trauma now. Like Guts did when he first uh, got out of it. Oh no, all the memories, all the memories of Judo, it all just flooded back. Oh, this isn't good. Oh no. Shit, dude. 
Oh, this sucks. Alright. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh, she's like panicking. She's like falling over. She's like getting. She's remembering some stuff. Oh, Guts is gonna go help her. Why would you do this? Why would you do this? Why would you do this, man? Guts has been through enough. Let him have it, dude. <laughs> Come on. So she's looking up, and I'll probably put the image on the side or something. She's looking up, and she sees Guts, but, like, basically every... I think it seems like every Apostle he's killed. And she sees, like, all of it. And he just looks, like, the way he... He pretty much has the image of like the way he used to look a lot like in the Black Swords mark, which is like black face with the one like white eye. So she's looking up at him. God damn it. Oh, okay, and that was the scream. So she's like, now she's screaming. God. No, Guts' face! His face, dude. Oh man, he looks so sad. Oh, dude. The pain, dude, man. Shit, I knew... Oh, man. I'm not disappointed because I figured... Part of me was hoping they would just have a normal conversation. But how the fuck can you, dude? You both experienced something. She hasn't really properly dealt with this trauma that happened like four or five years ago or whatever at this point. And he, he did. And now that she finally got her mind back, she has to remember everything. Like, all at once. But Guts' face, man, it just defeats me, man. He looks so fucking defeated. But she still can't see him. Damn, dude. That sucks, man. You know how painful that is to see the one person you love, and then that person just looks at you and just says... And just starts freaking out because of what happened? Oh man. Okay, I think this is this. God, bro. Okay, so, so Skull Knight appears. He's he's at the elf place. He appeared. The knight appears as the recurring nightmare widens the gulf between the two. What are his intentions? He's more than likely gonna help. I feel. I feel like he and Guts are like kindred spirits or something, or give him guidance or her guidance. So we'll definitely see. But that's the end of the chapter, right? Yeah. God damn it. So that's it for this chapter. And it says to be continued, which means there's no exact date for it. Fuck, dude. Oh, man. I. Oh, I hate being a Berserk fan. <laughs> okay, so I give my thoughts now then. Overall, awesome chapter. Uh, I think it was definitely like a 7 or like 8 out of 10. Just, just on the fact that like seeing Casca back and fighting and like short hair and everything and armored, uh, she looks dope. Every all of that, all of the Casca shit was amazing. It I, the only reason it docks points for me is because obviously she can't deal with the trauma, all of that shit, all at once. So it's realistic, but I'm still sad for guts because fuck, dude. It's so painful seeing how Miura draws Guts. Like, he... Guts is visibly thinner. He, he's like... His eyesight is blurring. The dude is in bad shape. And he's been going through all of this for her to protect her and his friends. And the fact that the one person he, like, loves loves can't see him or else she'll, like, bug out. Like... That, that just really sucks. Because I, I don't think she reverted to her back to her mental state. I don't think she's broken again. I just think she's just scared, like the last time. Because um, she freaked out. I'm assuming because I think that's where they're they're inferring that in 355 she freaked out. Gus hit away and was like, um, I "Guess she can't see me for now." Because obviously she knew he was there and everything. So the thing is, she just can't see him. And honestly, I'm not mad at that because it's just realistic. Like I, like I said reading it, Guts was able to adapt and cope with the trauma, however negative way it was in the Black Swords and Mark, just killing everything, and then coping with that he has to protect her, so development through him, 
So she she never got that chance because as soon as the eclipse ended, she just broke. So now she has to go through that and deal with that. And I think the Skull Knight at the end is definitely gonna help maybe Guts or uh, or Ka I think he's gonna talk to Casca maybe or something of that sort and maybe just explain or talk to her and like maybe give her that strength some more strength that she already has but it was awesome seeing Casca back to her former glory like she still has it the way she was dodging effortless, uh, effortlessly and like cutting up those golems everything was like pitch perfect I loved it so yeah it was about an 8 out of 10 for me uh, uh man I was waiting for this chapter for so long. I hate the comedy was good too I fucking hate that Miura like, make Pug say, like, oh, yeah, it's almost like we've been waiting 20 years for this. I don't know. But, yeah. And then the random Star Wars, like, Padawan joke. Okay. Um, but, yeah, I think it was very heartfelt. I love the imagery as well. The artwork. You can never go wrong with me or his artwork. It looks insane. I'm only mad. And the only reason this gets docked is because Miura is... It put Berserk to be continued. And when he puts to be continued, it, we don't know when the, the thing's coming out. Sometimes, even recently, like, before the last chapter, the chapters would have, like, a definitive, like, see you guys in two months or three months or whatever, at least. But now, he's working on a new manga with, like, Studio Gaga. So, it's like, man, that's the only disappointing part about it. But, aside from that, the chapter was great. I mean, all... Oh, I just, I just need more. I wish the chapter, I like for being gone for like eight or like almost a year or whatever since like 357. I just wish we got like 50 pages, but it is what it is. I give the chapter like an eight out of ten. Uh, Gracie and Casca, and I hope you guys enjoyed this different manga reaction slash review. Uh, obviously, I'll do the next Berserk chapter because, and we'll see how you guys like this one. With all that being said, I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe for new. Share the video if you enjoyed. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram, Twitter, my Snapchat down below in the description. We're so close to five, uh, a thousand subscribers. We're only 53 subs away. So if you guys enjoyed this and you're new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that sub button. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Bye, guys.